The union government plans to provide incentives worth 13,050 crore rupees out of the 19,744 crore rupees in support under the National Green Hydrogen Mission, two people aware of the development said. It plans to provide incentives totaling 17,490 crore rupees to produce green hydrogen and electrolyzers under the mission announced in February. Of this, 4,440 crore rupees would be allocated for the manufacturing of electrolyzers. For green hydrogen, the government plans to provide an incentive of up to 50 rupees per kilogram in the first year, which will be brought down and capped at 30 rupees per kilogram in the third year. In this video, let's go over some more details about this incentive program. According to a draft proposal, the center plans to give direct incentives in terms of rupees per kilogram, and the beneficiaries under the scheme will be selected through a competitive bidding process. In the first year, the incentive would be the highest and would gradually be lowered in the following two years, one of the two people cited above said on condition of anonymity. Applicants need to have experience developing at least 500 megawatts of renewable energy capacity over the past four years, or a minimum of 500,000 tons of ammonia or methanol, or 100,000 tons of hydrogen over the last four years. The scheme will kick off in financial year 26. The second person said that around 400,000 tons of capacity would be tendered each in the first and third quarters of financial year 24 and another 400,000 in the first quarter of the next financial year 25. In a bid to promote different pathways to produce green hydrogen, separate technology-specific bids may also be called. Responding to a mailed query from Mint, Bhupinder Singh Balla, Secretary of, Ministry of New and Renewable Energy, said, the strategic interventions for green hydrogen transition, site, program, under the National Green Hydrogen Mission, is a comprehensive incentive program to facilitate the growth of green hydrogen value chain in the country. Under the program, two distinct financial incentives, targeted at support for domestic manufacturing of electrolyzers, and production of green hydrogen have been proposed. The incentives will be awarded through a competitive bidding process, and the incentive amount will taper down annually. Draft concept notes on the site program have been circulated to industry chambers and associations for consultations, he added. The Indian government approved the National Green Hydrogen Mission with an initial outlay of 19,744 crore rupees in January. The aim is to enable the production of 5 million tons of green hydrogen per annum by 2030, which could potentially reach 10 million tons with the growth of export markets. The government hopes to turn India into a global hub for the production, use, and export of green hydrogen and its derivatives.